Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm coming at you with a new grocery haul. Uh, we went to the commissary like two days ago, but I really wasn't feeling filming it then, but um, I said that I would give you one. So I lined everything back out and I'm ready to show you what all I got with some open bags and boxes, but it works just the same. Here's an overview of what we got. We spent about $160 at the commissary. We saved $1.40, so not huge savings, and we spent a lot, but um, we needed a lot of stuff. So we'll get into it. All right, we'll just start down here at the left side. So Austin and I both really love these granola bars, and I figured they'd be really good for him for his work lunches along with these barbecue chips that he ate half of already. <laughs> and then I really wanted to try these kettle cooked sea salt and cracked pepper chips. Um, I like salt and pepper and I like kettle chips and yeah, so I'm really excited about them. I opened them, but I have not tried them yet. That's what sparked my idea to do this video. Um, open loaf bread, hamburger buns, cause Austin wants to do burgers sometime this week. Um, Fig Newtons and Chewy Chips Hoy Cookies. This is going to be a staple in this household, I swear. And then we got Hot Pockets um, and then Chicken Nuggets. And these are just for the days where I don't want to make food. And yeah, so that'll be good to have on hand. So then we got Boneless Skinless Chicken Breast Portions with Rib Meat. Um, they were out of like the normal whole chicken breast pieces again from the commissary. And so these are just like big chunks of them, um, which will do just the same. I want to make cracked chicken, which is cream cheese and the dry ranch seasoning packet. And so they work for that. I'm going to make it in the instant pot. Um, and then I got French fries to go with our burgers when we do that. I got vanilla and chocolate ice cream. They had a lot more exciting flavors, but I couldn't decide, so I just went with something classic. We got frozen broccoli and carrots. Um, my husband doesn't eat too many vegetables, but I'm trying to get him to eat cooked broccoli. He's really picky about it, but we're trying to do some baby steps. And then had to get some ranch because we were out. We have three pounds of 93% ground beef. Um, we're gonna do burgers, tacos, and I wanna do meatloaf. And then we got some Jimmy Dean regular sausage. So I wanna do like a pizza thing sometime this week and with Italian sausage, but I could not for the life of me find Italian sausage at the commissary. And I've looked three times, the last three times that I went, and it's just not meant to be. So I'm just gonna make my own Italian sausage out of this. And then we have bacon for breakfast since Austin's home now to eat breakfast with me. And it's not just, it doesn't have to be cereal every day now. And we got a couple packs of cheese hot dogs Fun fact, I refuse to eat um, regular hot dogs. It's either cheese dogs or turkey hot dogs. So that's what we got. Um, this is for my little pizza dish. It's gonna be in the Instant Pot. It's kind of like a pepperoni pizza, but like pasta. I don't know, I found it on the internet. It might be good, it might be gross. We have cooked ham and turkey for sandwiches again. Knock off uh, Reese's Puff cereal, freaking delicious. Baby carrots, and then I already opened this today for my lunch, but we got fancy greens and spinach for a salad. I got two bell peppers, I already cut one up. I'm putting those in my salad just for a little something extra. I'm really missing uh, Subway salads or Woodworth salads from college, so. I need a little extra besides my leaves. And then Austin's 1% milk and my 
almond milk. I do sometimes still use this for things like vanilla almond milk. You can't use to cook with it because it doesn't turn out good unless you're like baking something sweet. So this is a go-to still. Then we got Aunt Jemima pancakes. We already have syrup, but like I'm really craving some pancakes for whatever reason. I really wanted the protein pancakes, but I couldn't find those. So for now, this is what we're working with. I got this almond coco loco yogurt. It was like 99 cents and I love these Giovanni flips. Delicious. So we're doing tacos tonight and I was gonna do this Spanish rice on the side. And I think that'll be really good. I have some black beans that I might throw in it or keep on the side because Austin doesn't eat beans. So I'm really excited for tacos tonight. And then got tortilla shells for them. Tea bags, we can make sweet tea. And country time, lemonade, pink lemonade and cherry Kool-Aid because we were drinking sweet tea all the time. But yeah, so all in all, it was a successful trip. We should be able to go off this for probably a little over a week, which is really nice. So, yeah. Thank you. Um, subscribe, comment, let me know if you want me to do more of these or if you have any ideas for future grocery hauls. All right. Bye-bye. Have a great day.